I'm back in the prayer garden. We're continuing our series, 1 Timothy 2, daily prayer for our government officials, both elected and appointed. If you don't have a capital prayer guide to help you along, write me at info, I-N-F-O, at faithandaction.org. We're going to the state of Louisiana, or Louisiana, where I spend a good amount of time. Uh, over the last 20 years, I've been preaching there at least once every year, sometimes more, and I love the people of Louisiana, so please join me in prayer. Dear Lord, we pray for the people of Louisiana. We pray for the state government officials, beginning with Governor Bobby Jindal, who is Catholic, with his family, staff, and advisors, for the legislators, and for the judicial branch in Louisiana, we lift them up to you and pray your will be done in and through them. We pray, Lord, for the congressional delegation, beginning with Senators Mary Landro, who is Catholic, and David Vitter, who is Catholic, with their families, staff, and advisors. Let your will be known to them and give them hearts to obey. And when they don't, Lord, lovingly correct them. We pray for the members of the House of Representatives, Steve Scalise, who is Catholic, Ann Joseph Cow, who is Catholic, Charlie Malankin, who is Catholic, John Fleming, who is Southern Baptist, Rodney Alexander, who is Baptist, Bill Cassidy, who is Christian, and Charles Bustany, who is Episcopal. Lord, we lift these members of the House up to you with their family members, staff, and advisors that they might know your will and obey your word. And when they don't, Lord, they will feel the loving correction of your Father's heart. Now we pray for this great state of Louisiana, Louisiana, and we lift up to you its people and government. In Jesus' holy name, I ask it. Amen. 